your brain. What do you think of when I say that? Perhaps you're asking yourself, what do you mean? Who has my brain? It's right here. But do you really have your brain? Or has society stolen your brain from you? We're put in schools and our brains are stuffed with information that doesn't necessarily serve our daily lives. We're herded to think a certain way, to behave a certain way. We're praised when we listen to our teachers. We receive good grades when we learn exactly what a textbook tells us to. And if we don't, we're labeled as misfits and failures. We're bred to compete. Instead of lifting each other up, we're taught to push each other down and walk over whoever is stopping you from making it to the top. Think about all the times you had to fight to be where you are now, and you had to fight. And social media, we get so mad when we get lied to in person, and yet we are lying to each other every single day in every image we post that puts filters on our reality. The further you are from showing your true self, the more likes you get. Think about that. The education system. The political system. The religious system. The social media system. Have they made us love ourselves or love them more? Do these systems that were created to serve the public do more to feed our self-esteem and confidence or feed our fears and insecurities? Depression. Anxiety. Loss of motivation. Apathy. Numbness. All come from society having taken your brain's attention from you and focusing it on them. They've stolen your brain right from under you while you were distracted. 99% of us coast through life without even realizing this is happening. This is the greatest mass con and heist of all time, and yet no one is talking about it. Wake up. Take back your brain. Take back your brain. Take, Take back, back your brain. brain. Take, Take back, back what's, what's yours. yours. Take back your health. Take back your happiness. Take back your peace. When you have that, you have everything. When you lose that, you lose everything. Creating health, happiness, and peace with your brain is not a luxury reserved for a special few. These are your fundamental human rights.